It's 1.35 and I'm having my first meal. I just got back from a run with my friend and I'm having some oats. I put in some pumpkin spice, some pumpkin pie mix, some ice cubes because I was really impatient and just a little bit more water and that was pretty much it. Super simple, super cheap recipe. I don't even know if you could call this a recipe. I'm literally just chopping potatoes into eighths or quarters depending on how big they are and throwing them in the oven. I ate this a lot when I was in college because it's just so cheap. Uh, it actually tastes pretty good and it's really quick to make. I've thrown these potatoes in naked before and they taste great just like that, but I decided to be a little bit fancy and put some taco seasoning on there. And we were out of taco seasoning, so I actually decided to make some for me and the fam. And I'm clearly not going to eat this whole thing this, <laughs> during this week, so I didn't, you know, I'm, I'm not including uh, spices or condiments or anything in this week's uh, groceries. But anyway, with that said, here is the recipe. I might half cup and two tablespoons of chili powder and then I add in one tablespoon of garlic powder, one tablespoon of onion powder, one tablespoon of red pepper flakes, one tablespoon of oregano, two tablespoons of paprika, a quarter cup plus one tablespoon of cumin, one teaspoon of salt, and three tablespoons plus one teaspoon of pepper. So after it's all shooked up and whatnot, I already sprayed this with oil a while ago and then you just uh sprinkle around there, put taco seasoning on potatoes. That's just crazy talk. And I'm gonna put this camera down so I can actually put it on because it's really hard to hold the DSLR and shake stuff onto stuff. So that's what it looks like when they're all done. I tried to put it in at uh, 450 degrees, but I, I turned the dial to 400 and it turned out they're at 525. So uh, yeah, that's why they're a little bit more burnt than I would like, but uh, they still, you know, the fork goes through them pretty easily, so I think we all good. But this masterpiece of a recipe is not done until you douse it in ketchup. And I don't know about you guys, but I like to eat potatoes with my ketchup. I'm eating the tortillas. I just put them in the oven on, uh, what do you have it on, like 400 or 450 or something? Uh, 400. 400? Yeah, so I just had them in the in there for like five minutes on 400. So I can make my own chips, basically, from the, the tortillas. Just gotta, I don't know, break them like that. And I made my own snowflake. Wow, look at that. Isn't that cool? <laughs> so that's uh, three tortillas, and I'm going to be dipping that in salsa, and that's probably all I'm going to have today. And a snowflake. And a snowflake. But we'll be back to show you Dad's french fries, because they look a little bit different than mine. He just finished off some, but they're also in the oven. Dad's famous fries. Well, these are good. Yeah? Well, Dad put on uh... Dad, what'd you put on them? Put, Did you say vanilla? Yeah, vanilla. I said canola. Oh. He put canola and. This is that our new stuff secret weapon. It's our new secret weapon? That's a dad used anyway. Yeah, and canola oil. I just saw it at the Maybe BJ's and I was like, yeah. The BJ's. The it's BJ's. Mine. I will have that in my life. And I got it. Just like that. Getting ready for bed now. Good to know. Yeah.